A sword is a living thing. A spirit. Born of fire. Captured in steel. Some think of it as a tool to serve our needs. But we are merely the caretakers. Even though the spirit inside may be captive, it can never be tamed. Like any other wild beast, it must be kept well fed. And its food of choice is blood. <laughs> I told you not to call me anymore. Just uh, hear me out, all right? I, I, I've got something I think you're really gonna want to see. <sighs> More counterfeit Roman coins? That wasn't my fault. Those were very convincing replicas. I'm onto something big. You and your wishful thinking. Just come by, please check it out. And if, if it's nothing, I promise I will never bother you again. Fine, just this once. You will not regret.
to see you again. In two minutes, Chief. Nice dress. Where's the rest of it? I see you haven't changed. Yeah, but you sure have. What's with the fancy getup? You got a hot date? I run in different circles now. May I? Yes, of course. These circles... They wouldn't happen to include a certain German fellow, would they? He's Austrian, <laughs> but I wouldn't expect you to know the difference. The guy's a schmuck. I always thought you preferred the down-to-earth type. These days I'm into the pays-his-own-tab type. Where'd you pick this up? You know, I can't reveal my sources. It's not stolen, if that's what you're thinking. You're many things, but a criminal's not one of them. What do you think? I gotta talk to some people first, but this could be a major find. Congrats, Chief. <clears throat> Looks like you finally got what you always wanted. Not everything. I should go. in remarkable condition for a sword of its age. As you can see, from the grain and the steel, it's hand-forged. And that maker's mark there, it's engraved, not stamped. Ah, yes, Muramasa. You're familiar? Of course. He was one of the most famous swordsmiths in feudal Japan, and a complete psychopath. Most of his swords were destroyed after his death. They were considered too dangerous. To find one still intact is very rare. So it's worth a lot, then. Good luck finding a buyer. Anyone who knows the value of a Murmaza blade also knows the risks. What kind of risks? The swords are supposedly prone to violence, like the creator. Legend has it, the steel craves the taste of blood. It manipulates its owner, twists its mind, turning friends into enemies. But I wouldn't worry about it. Knowing Royce, it's just another thing. Hey, you should smile. You're here with me now. You're pretty winsome. Come on. There's some people I want you to meet. In a minute. There's something I need to do first. I'll be right back. She's not yours anymore, Royce. She's mine. Yesterday? You got three seconds to open the door. I'm calling the sheriff. I've had it with you. I need my money. Wanna talk? I need my money. Let's talk. Oh, fuck, dude. What the fuck do you think this is, Terry? Where's my money? Or this is gonna be the world's shortest conversation. It's gonna be short, all right?
Where's the sword? You want it? It'll cost you. This isn't about money, Royce. That thing's dangerous. I'd feel better if you put it away. <laughs> Why? Does it frighten you? First, let's talk price. There won't be a sale. I'm sorry. There's a problem with the sword. Are you kidding me? It's perfect. It's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. It has a long history of murder and suicide. People think it's cursed. <laughs> it's cursed! <laughs> what do you think this is, the Middle Ages? <laughs> you know, and who would come up with a stupid idea like... What? No, I'm, I'm just trying to help. By screwing me over? Fuck you. This isn't you. This is the sword talking. Listen to yourself. Oh, so it's messing with your head. So now you think I'm crazy. Please put the damn thing away. Fine. Who's the crazy one now? Hey, where are you going? To destroy it. I don't think so. Come on! Lieutenant Chief. <laughs>